everybody and happy Thursday. Welcome back to a brand new video. I really do hope that you enjoy. I have literally forgotten how to intro a video. How can I forget how to do this? I do it twice a week. Good afternoon everybody and happy Thursday. Welcome to a brand new video. I really do hope that you enjoy this video and if you are a new viewer and you haven't yet, please subscribe to my channel using the link down below and also like this video and hit the bell notification if you haven't already just so you are notified every time that I upload a brand new video. In today's video I will be bringing you haul three of three this will be the last haul video for a very long time I've done so much spending over the last few weeks and let's just say I have no more money to spend on doing another haul video or purchasing another item that I do not need so this will be the last of the hauls for quite a long time but I will be doing an Amazon haul and I am showing you with some things that I brought from Boots just to add into this video as well as I would love to show share them all with you. I do have some skincare, some nail stuff, some self-help stuff, journals and books to show you. So very different from a Topshop and an ASOS haul I know. So please stay tuned to see everything that I have purchased from Amazon and Boots. Okay, so I will firstly start off with boots, only because I have brought three things from there and this is mainly an Amazon haul, so I will get those things out of the way first. Of course, I have repurchased my Ola Hendrickson Truth Serum Set. This is £32. If you are a new subscriber, you will not know, but this is my holy grail every video these dogs just want to make an appearance it's like a regular occurrence now and it's doing my head in this is my holy grail skincare routine i absolutely love the truth set from arla henriksen in the here you get a truth serum a brightening cream and a banana bright eye cream if you haven't tried out the ola henriksen range i would a hundred percent recommend and also why have i gone so dark there's a lot of problems going on in this video um, but also if you are interested in seeing how I use these products and how I use them on my face then I will link my skincare routine down below for you all just to go and have a watch if you are interested in trying this. These are not the full size products, the full size products are around 50 to 60 pounds each which is why I normally just pick up this because it is a little bit cheaper. Granted the full size products will obviously last you a bit longer than this but to me this is more justifiable than spending 50 pounds just on one product. But either way these are still quite good sized products. My other ones I am still using but I'm sort of now nearly running out of and with with the delivery time that everything is taking to arrive on I thought that I'd better pick this up and make sure that I have it for when I do run out of my product. We also picked up the Ola Hendrickson Truth Juice Daily Cleanser. This is the cleanser that goes alongside the other products that I have shown you and I actually have not used this one before so I am super super excited to try this one out to see if it's just as good as the serum, moisturiser and eye cream. I'm going to assume that this will be just as good as it's from the same range. I do normally use the Elemis Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm but unfortunately for the price that that is £42 I have run out of it super quickly and I have used a lot of it. So to me £42 for something that isn't lasting as long as it should to me it's just not worth it and I would rather try something out and get a cheaper alternative. So this was £22 which is half price I believe. If not you can correct me in the comments. 
Um, but I'm hoping that this may last a little bit longer than the Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm. But even if it doesn't, it's still half price, definitely a lot cheaper. So this will be more justi justifiable, should I say, to repurchase. And I'm going to give that a go tonight. I haven't used it yet because I've been saving it to show you in this video. So I cannot wait to take my makeup off this evening and try that cleanser. And then the last thing that I brought, which will become to no surprise for my regular viewers, is that I did purchase the St. Ives Apricot Scrub. This is the blemish control one because I didn't have the normal ordinary one, which I normally get. But everybody knows that I absolutely rave about this and I love it for if you have any breakouts or spots on your face. This is absolutely amazing for getting rid of them or reducing them in size. For skin like me, this is really good for smoothing out your skin. I think this is around two to four pounds and I swear I did order the bigger size. But I do have a 150 mil one which is maybe like this so just a little bit bigger and um, but they sent me this one but i swear i did order the bigger size so those were just the three things which i ordered on the boots website and i cannot wait to try out that cleanser i just love Al hendrickson and i would definitely be using more of her products as i go along so we are now moving on to everything that i have brought off amazon i have kept all this in a little pile because I knew that I wanted to do this video and I have already started to use some of the things so I can give you an honest review on some stuff. I did actually want to start off with the littler items first as I am turning in my chair as I'm trying to pick this stuff up which is great oh my god ellie stop turning in your chair so the first two things that i wanted to show you led on really nicely from the skincare products and these are all to do with self-help and self-development so the first thing that i purchased was actually on the recommendation of Gemma louise miles who also has a youtube channel and an instagram i'm pretty sure you all know who she is but in one of her vlogs she mentioned this book and this is the rules of life by richard tembler he does a selection of these he does the rules of love and the rules of thinking but this is the one that i wanted to start off with because Gemma said that this really got her into manifestation and the law of attraction which is what i really want to start getting into so this is basically a book on personal code living a better happier and more successful life this is not like a normal style book each page is a different rule and there's loads of different chapters of this as well there is rules for you partnership rules family and friends rules social rules and the rules of happiness and each section has a load of different rules i don't normally read this every single day i only read it when i feel like i really need to or if i'm having an afternoon to myself for like a self-care day then i will read this book this was around six to eight pounds i believe so a little bit pricier but definitely worth it if you are wanting to change your life and then to go alongside that i actually picked myself up a journal this was around 15 pounds i believe and this is the legend planner so this is what the front of it looks like and it is so 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 pretty i absolutely love this it's not real leather but it does feel like leather it's a hard cover the pages are really really thick and this is just super super high quality i have already started using this this is a bit like the law of attraction planner so the massive pink one that Gemma uses and Al Darby has this is basically the exact same thing just a smaller version I found that one a bit impractical and it was around £25 get June to June on that one so I am running out so I did purchase this which is undated which I prefer because you can use it as and when really and there isn't a time frame in here it just includes 
your awareness and self-discovery, your vision. You can then make a list of your dreams down the side, your most important life goals. You can't really see it, but there is so much on here. Your one year goals, your strategy, your daily rituals, your three month goals. And then it just goes into like a normal diary where you get a month to view. And then you have your week view where you write everything down there's so much to this planner it's so detailed and if you really want to manifest and write down things to help with self-development and trying to attract the law of attraction and having things come into your life then this is perfect it gives you a vision board in here you can write down your goals and this is just incredible and something that i've been using every sunday i've created myself like a manifestation day where i spend a morning or an afternoon reading my self-help books writing in my journals just trying to manifest and put out to the universe what i want but actually i am filming a youtube video where i show you everything that i do in my manifestation law of attraction days so stay tuned for that where i show you how i use all of these things but if you click on the link you can see inside of the journal and all the different pages it just gives you a more in-depth description i have written in this so i don't really want to go showing you everything that's in this journal as it's quite personal um, but I would 110% recommend something like that, especially with writing down all of your goals and what you want to achieve in life. If you write it down, it will go out to the universe. That makes me sound so weird, but it's so true. I cannot deal. And the next thing that I picked up is a gel nail kit. I have opened it and used it, which is how I achieved these white nails. I absolutely love them. Um, but I will go through with you everything that is in this box. So I did buy this gel kit on Amazon for... 22 to 25 pounds i believe so it was one of the cheaper ones and um, because you can get quite expensive ones on amazon for 25 pound i did get to pick my own 10 colors so normally with amazon the gel kits come with set colours and you can't normally change them and half the time I only like two or three out of them. I don't tend to like all of the colours that come with the kit but with this one you could choose your own which really drew me to it and really wanted me to purchase it. So of course the first thing that you get is your UV lamp. This is what you put your gel nails under. It comes with 120 seconds 90 seconds and 60 seconds and it is a usb so i normally just plug it into my iphone charger and that normally works really well you then receive one of these boxes and inside this box you will have all of your gel colors one isn't in here because that's the white one that i used but these are all of the colors that i picked up i brought a black a white a red a grey a grey glitter a khaki colour and then like a mixture of nudes I won't show you all of them because I think that would take a really long time but I will write in the description the numbers to each of the colours that I picked up and when you choose your own 10 colours you do have to email the seller with the numbers of the colours that you want so the ones that I chose I will leave a little list in the description box just to give you an idea of the ones that I picked up you will then receive a little bag like so and inside you get two nail files these are just plain normal nail files you then get these for if you want to gel your toes which I have actually used and these are so so helpful and um, it just means that you won't get any of the gel on any of the skin or anything like that and these are actually really really useful and not something that I thought that I would normally need. You then also receive a base coat and a top coat is definitely essential if you are doing gel nails and you then also receive some little gems 
as well as some wipes to remove the gel and there's just loads of little things in here which are really really useful so you also receive one of these cuticle oils which is strawberry flavored which is absolutely unreal and it just looks like so and then it has a little tip which you then just brush on your cuticle. This just helps for it to be really smooth and not as red or irritated. I then also ordered to go alongside this, the Blue Sky Builder Gel. This was just so that I could do my own gel extensions. So currently I have on press on nails with gel over the top, so instead of a normal nail polish, but I did want to venture into it more and try and do my own gel extensions to believe that I was at a nail salon. So that is why I brought that. I then also brought some clear gel tips, just so I could attempt to do my own gel extensions and these are what they look like. I absolutely love the smell of these. It smells like a nail salon and I just absolutely adore that smell. So that was the gel nail set that I picked up. Super basic, but it does work really, really well and it definitely gets the job done. As I said, that was around 20 to 25 pounds. And I will leave the link down below with also the numbers of the colours that I picked up. I've had so many questions on Instagram and so many DMs when I'm showing my nails, what product I used and where I ordered it from and if I could send them the link. One of my upcoming videos as well is how I do my gel nails. So I will be showing you how I achieve these, which is something that I have been doing for so many years. I have always done my own nails. I've never really got them done professionally unless it's a special occasion. So in an upcoming video, please make sure to stay tuned to see how I do my own nails at home. That was also a really highly requested video and I cannot wait for you all to see that because I think it's so super informative and definitely tells you in depth how I get to do my own nails. So that was one of the main things that I picked up off Amazon. And then the last two things that I picked up off Amazon, I know this video has been super long and in depth and I do apologize, but we are nearly done is two books. These are from recommendations from Sophia and Chintzia, mainly Sophia. She always shares her book recommendations on her vlogs and on her Instagram. And I've definitely become such a bookworm this lockdown that I'm so excited to read these. So the first one that I picked up was Sadie Ryan Behind Closed Doors. And this is quite a thin book. It's not very long and the words are quite small. So this would definitely not take you long to read at all. But I love anything to do with like thriller, crime, murders, gangs, anything like that I'm all about. I will read you the blurb the back of the book just in case you are interested in anything that I am showing you. So this basically says um, Megan Pearson starts work at Tina's law firm and with her arrival the perfect world Tina has built for herself starts to collapse. It soon becomes clear that the newcomer is intent on inf infiltrating every aspect of her life. Something obviously is obviously wrong with Megan, but nobody else seems to see it. As the mind games and manipulations continue, Tina comes to the sickening conclusion that now she's opened the door to Megan, it's going to be impossible to make her leave. How good does this book sound? Oh my god, I cannot wait to start reading this. As I said, I will leave the link to this down below and I think I paid around five, six pounds for this. So again, not super expensive. And then the last book that I picked up is quite a lot thicker. So this would take you a little bit longer to read. Um, but this is called The Family Upstairs by Lisa Jewell. This is One House, Two Families, Three Bodies. And this just caught my attention instantly. Sharia Leeper has commented on this book, which is who I normally read with regards to crime and thriller. She's done The Couple Next Door and things like that. And this one says, be careful who you let in. In a large house in London's fashionable Chelsea, a baby is awake in her cot. 
well fed and cared for, she is happily waiting for someone to pick her up. In the kitchen lie three decom decomposing corpses. Close to them is a hastily scrawled note. They've been dead for several days. Who has been looking after the baby and where did they go? I just cannot wait to get my hands in this book. I actually had goosebumps reading the blurb. This just sounds right up my street. You will not want to put this down and this is something that I just cannot wait to read. So these are the two books that I have picked up. I do want to get my hands on Normal People. It's sold out on Amazon and Amazon do the best delivery so it's the only place I want to order it from. WH Smiths are also selling it and Waterstones are. However, their delivery time is like 6 to 10 days which I cannot cannot wait that long for this book if you don't know about normal people it is a series on the bbc which i finished in a day it's absolutely incredible please 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 go and watch that if you haven't already although i'm pretty sure that everybody has watched it by now but this is going to conclude my amazon and boots haul everybody i really do hope that you have enjoyed this video and liked seeing what i have purchased as i said all the links will be down below to everything that i've picked up if you are interested in buying any of this for yourself please let me know which thing you are most excited for out of this video and what you would love to try yourself or purchase if there are any other video ideas that you would like to see then please let me know down below as i need to start planning my content for the next month and i hope to see you all in my next video thank you so much for watching